To unlock the secret sauce in Master Mode's dogfighting, tell me what all these clips have in common. Did you see it? In every single one of these pushes that gives me great position, I get there by putting my opponent in a vertical orientation on my screen. In master modes, the fastest direction of rotation is pure pitch, and the slowest is pure yaw. When I put my opponent in this orientation, I've created a situation where I have optimal rotational advantage. I've started to call this in the vertical. You can tell you've got someone in the vertical when the line you draw between their wingtips is perfectly up and down on your screen. This causes their aim to fall behind while yours can still pull onto target and allows you to move off their screen into what PvP players call the slot. Once there, the opponent's going to naturally roll to pitch onto you, and this exposes the broadest profile of their ship, which we call the pancake. If you continue to put them in the vertical and push against their slowest axis of rotation, you'll be able to keep them in a permanent spin, always trying to catch up while you can dish out maximum damage. Now, this doesn't mean you always want to have them in the vertical. If you get a nice big pancake and they're having trouble catching up, feel free to punish that weak profile for a while. But if you do see their nose start to catch up, make sure you put them in the vertical again. While it looks simple enough, keeping someone in the vertical takes quite a few fundamental skills, all being used the right amount and at the right times. Specifically, you'll need throttle control, rolling aim to stay in pitch, proper boosting, and a strong understanding of how your inputs affect your ship while decoupled. There are about a million videos on each of these, but since you're already here, I'll give you a drill to work on all of them. It's nothing new that PvP folks don't already know, but since you're here, let's show it. This is called the pole drill, the station drill, antenna drill is what some people might call it. To start, you're going to find any narrow column on a free flight map. The objective is to only rotate in pure pitch and orbit the column as quickly and as closely as possible while decoupled, with emphasis on closely. If you find yourself slingshotting past it, it's because you're strafing forward too much or too hard, and if you're not crashing, it means that you're not pushing yourself hard enough. Once you've got a tight, controlled orbit in this drill, you can start trying it using moving targets in Pirate Swarm. Then you'll be well on your way to getting Pancake on real players in true Sweatlord fashion. While this technique isn't the end-all be-all to Master Mode's combat, and nor is it brand new, I hope my way of teaching it and highlighting its efficacy in Master Modes help you to build a reliable and lethal foundation for your fights. I do plan on making a more detailed video in the future on exactly what strafes and when I'm using to get into and hold this position, so if it's something that you'd like to hear more about and get more drills and generally more instructional content, I really enjoyed making this video and plan to make more so feel free to subscribe leave a comment shoot me a message on discord asking for something specific i loved your feedback and it's what helps me grow the channel thanks for tuning in and until next time fly slippery